Yo, Internet, I am Calvin, and this is Space Engineers, an update video that is, well, it's, I was going to say about long overdue, but it's, a, uh, it's an update video for the latest update that came out today, but I haven't done an update video in ages, and, um, I wanted to do this one just because I think it's really, really cool. So, the first thing I want to show you is contr direct control of a turret, um, so we'll go here, we'll go to the, uh, the gr Gatling turret right there, and we go with this new button appears called Control. And you get this really awesome, uh, you know, HUD with a uh, crosshair, and you're staring down the barrel of this thing. You don't need a camera or anything. This is directly from the, the, uh, like just with the Gatling turret. You do, however, say for example, I want to, uh, you know, control that turret up there. I do have to have antennas uh, on the ship and on the, um, the station or the other place. Or yeah, the ship, the two ships I'm going to be like using, um, like normal. Um, then this is going to lead me to my next thing I want to show you. If you destroy uh, blocks, instead of it giving nothing and disappearing, it gives this new item called scrap metal. And I'll show that by just, I think scrap metal will drop in creative. I hope it will. Um, if it doesn't, I have another way of showing you. Okay, so it works in uh, survival mode. Um, what I did was, I you know, this scrap metal just dropped, but I'll show you the process of what I did. I. Uh, I, so let's see, we drill this thing down a bit, like right there, and we use this. Uh, it kind of fell, but scrap metal came out of it. Um, if we go to just do this fully, I haven't tried that yet, but we'll probably drop scrap metal. If it doesn't take for fucking ever. Yep, okay, drop scrap metal. Awesome. And scrap metal can be... That was actually, that was 400 scrap metal. Scrap metal can be, uh, smelted back into iron ingots. So I'm, I have this arc furnace over here. I just drop... Oh, whoops, I can't, uh, it's only for iron ore. I put that there, I'm supposed to thinking I could do this, but, uh, I'll just throw it in the refinery, and it's just cranking out iron ore. So you get, so I'm not sure what the return rate of this stuff is. Probably less, if, like, to, to make sense, but, um, it's good that it gives you something, but it's better than, like, previously where we had nothing. But, um, that isn't the coolest thing. So those are two cool things. I showed you the, the turret, uh, control and, and, you know, this new item dropping, uh, thing. But that's not the coolest. The coolest, which I'll have to switch back over to creative to show you. Okay, so I'm back in creative. And the coolest thing about this entire update is placeable asteroids. Not just that, customizable ones too. So what we do is we hit shift F10 and the spawn menu comes up, which we normally had, but it just had the items, uh, so you can just, like, make like this shit like that just happen bye have a great time um but <laughs> this is just I, I copy i didn't really copy and paste but you can actually you can copy and paste maybe not um you can hit control x on them to delete them but i'll show you how to create them so we hit shift uh f10 and first off we have the asteroid type and there's tons of types most of them i don't know what they mean but excuse me they um there's like this one right here, 256 by 256 by 256, um, is fucking huge. I don't know why I just burped again. Um, but now, so the core material, the, uh, material that you'll be mining that's inside this asteroid, you can choose from here. It can be anything. Um, I, I'll make it uranite, which is uranium. And the surface one, which, these gold ones, I made gold. Um, let's make it just like a, let's make it cobalt. Maybe that'll look cool. And, uh, we can also do add random materials, so it'll throw in, like, some iron in there, some, uh, magnesium, some silicon, just, like, randomly, just to, you know, make it more realistic, in a sense. We click spawn asteroid. The bigger the asteroid it is, the longer it will take to spawn. It shouldn't take, like, like, generating our asteroids can take a long time, so it says, um, holy shit. That's, uh, that's a pretty big asteroid. <laughs> So if you just, let's just put this right there, place that, just click in it. And I'm, my computer's going, I'm dropping a few frames, but that's because it just spawned this thing in. And so the outside is entirely cobalt, while the inside is uranium uh, mixed with uh, some random ore and stuff like that. So I think we have our lights on, yeah. Let's uh, let's go mine some, like look at all of this, all of this right here. Just like uranium, and then we have some... I think just stone and like th this right here is just craziness. Um, so normally this would be iron, like out of a normally spawned one, but let's see, we got lag. We got lag. I just mined up some lag. I love that stuff. It's really rare, you know. You'll never, uh, you never 
have too much lag. Um, yeah, I don't know what the fuck that was about. Uh, so yeah, here, I'll go to the outside to better prove it. Um, to show that we have cobalt, which was what we chose, yeah, as a service material. So, we'll go right here. And it shows cobalt, you know, just on the outside here. But we just go here. And we have, uh, we have some cobalt. Freaking sweet. So you can do that in a or, uh, in a creative world. Um, or you say you have your survival world, you make it creative, you log in, you do this thing, you place it wherever the hell you want, and um, then you can go back to survival and it'll still be there and all that. So this will drastically increase the length, or the, yeah, the length of the lifespan, I guess you could say, of the worlds, because, you know, you have limited asteroids. Like this one, this world itself has naturally four, and um, so we got, like, one, two, these are, like, the large ones, one, two, um, three... And I think four, yeah, yeah, one, two, three, four. So just these ones right here. Um, and you know that's not enough. You can you're gonna run out fairly soon. You know at least or at least get bored. But so here I, uh, you can also paste them inside of each other. So it's just like you can merge on them and stuff. I'll show you how to do that real fast. It's really easy. Let's do a smaller one. Let's do that one. I think that was a smaller one. It might have been even bigger. I don't know. Ah, it's roughly the same size. That's fucking huge. It's fucking huge! Oh my god. So yeah, what we could do is we could just... We could, uh, even put it inside this right here. Just bam. Oh, I can't place... Never mind. I can't put it right there. Come on, right there. 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 There we go. Um, my headphones died. Hopefully it doesn't affect the audio in this, but... Um... Yeah, I don't... Just my listening headphones. But yeah, just... You can freaking do anything with these. This is awesome. I'm probably gonna add a couple of them to my Let's Play world just so I can spice things up a bit, you know what I'm saying? Um, so we got some uranium and stuff, just like I uh, had it set to do it. You know, we got some, oh, mined up some more lag. Look at that. That's that's some that's some quality shit right there. Uh, yeah. We got, yep, there we go, uranium. And uh, that's all there is in this update. I think it's really cool, and it's kind of needed. Um, Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, comment, favorite, share with your friends. All awesome stuff. Share with your enemies too. I don't really care. Just share it. Yeah, and uh, see you guys next time. Peace out.